And the winner is, is the name of our final round. I'm going to give the teams a series of opinion polls and it's up to them to buzz in and tell me who or what they think came top. Here is your first one. Top thing men look for in a pub. I think the top thing I look for in a pub is a door. <laughs> I always want to first hear, how do I get in? <laughs> <laughs> and then I would like a fine selection of organic wines and world music on the jukebox. <laughs> Stop at you. <laughs> <laughs> Ruth, what do you look for in a pub? Um, normally the bar. <laughs> it is drink related. Oh, oh it's so a good selection of drink. lagers, beers. Oh, doubles, doubles offer. Oh, two doubles, hour, Dub two doubles hour. for Happy hour is the right answer. Rick is going again. Yes! Come on! Oh, some price and a beer, that's the same. Yes, the top thing men look for in a pub is happy hour. Most unlucky thing that can happen to you. <laughs> Is it leaving war-torn Basra, having sex with a minging immigration officer, then being re-owned in Nottingham? <laughs> uh, that is significantly worse than what I've got down here, but this is... <laughs> you've got to remember this is a survey by direct line. The unluckiest thing I've ever heard it happen to anybody... Do you ever hear this story about... This is true, sorry. Fabio, the, the male model. You ever heard of Fabio? He's had, he was his male model, lived in Hollywood, and he had loads of, like... He was on loads of posters in the 80s, thick hair. He was on, this is a true story, he was on a roller coaster yes. in a Disney World and he was hit in the face with a goose. <laughs> a goose, he's going on this roller coaster, he's one of the best looking men in the world and a goose hit him in the face <laughs> and ruined his career, smashed all his face to smithereens. Yeah, that was unlucky for him, what about the goose? The goose got in the papers. Most geese don't get in the papers. <laughs> <laughs> on a similar note, very uh, completely true story, Aristotle, the great thinker, yeah. he, he died, Aristotle, when a hawk or an eagle was carrying a tortoise that he had you know, take it from the ground for food. It dropped the tortoise, it fell 10,000 feet and hit Aristotle on the head. Which means that one of the most cleverest men in the world, in that flash of insight just before he died, yeah. thought, I've just been hit on the head by a f tortoise. <laughs> That's his last thought, a great man. Yeah. yeah. Probably thought, tortoises are heavy. <laughs> Let's write that down. Oh. <laughs> It's to do with kind of homes and, you know, something that might happen in your home. Is it your house being flooded? Oh, plumber, plumber It's problems. to do with flooding, but something else as well? You've just decorated, you've just painted, you've just put a That's carpet, the right though. answer, yeah. Yes, yes. Yes. yes, according to this survey from Direct Line, the most unlucky thing that can happen to you is your house flooding after you've decorated it, unless you've decorated it in the style of a fantasy mermaid kingdom, <laughs> in which case it's the icing on the cake. <laughs> Well, that noise tells me it's the end of the round and the end of the game, which means the final scores are Sean, David and Ruth have six points, but Dave, Ulrika and Alan have nine points. They're the winners. Yay!